work that has been considered to be traditionally female has always been undervalued and it's put us in an awkward position with AI. I'm Dr. Anna Kalshman, I'm an industrial organizational psychologist and I research the unwritten rules of work. I wrote an article on this last year, I'll give you the brief summary. Essentially, we have classified work into what is considered uh, high value and low value and anything that was considered feminine was low value and in that is anything with soft skills things like teaching service work administrative work etc and men have been penalized for coming across as too agreeable i cite this in my upcoming book so we've rewarded and given high status positions to men without soft skills punished men with soft skills and paid women very little who have soft skills and now we have ai that can do a lot of hard skills, not anything brand new. It's, I, I call it, it's not generative AI, it's copy and paste AI or paraphrase AI, but it can do things like tell you what you need to code and even certain mathematics and such. Still has a lot of wildly inaccurate information, but now more than ever, what's gonna set you apart is your soft skills. And so the question I pose in this blog is, do you think it's going to close our gender gaps? My answer is in the blog if you wanna check it out, but curious to hear yours.